click the thumbs up button click the subscribe button and the notification button so TMZ posted this story on May 7th of 2019 titled <laughs> Chris Brown scary home visit from lady claiming he cursed her son listen to this crap y'all TMZ writes Chris Brown got wrapped into <laughs> Chris Brown got wrapped into some bad juju after cops say a woman trekked across the country trying to get him to remove a curse she believes Chris Brown inflicted on her son Cops responded to a call Saturday night reporting a strange woman with a preteen who was seen wandering around Chris Brown's LA area property, throwing a Bible over his wall no less. Officers responded and they got quite the tale from the woman. Law enforcement sources tell TMZ she says she had flown into town from Texas that day with her boy, all in the hopes of convincing Chris to lift some voodoo. We're told she felt the presence of a Bible on his lawn would help lift the curse. As for why she thought all of this, pretty clearly, cops figured she might have some mental health issues, uh, you think? She was, taken in for, <laughs> she was taken in for evaluation, and her son was taken into protective custody. Chris wasn't directly involved in the incident. He wasn't home at the time. We know Chris luckily dodged the encounter because he was partying it up with Jake Paul, Lamar Odom, and a bunch of his celeb pals in Calabasas on Saturday night for designer's 22nd birthday. This weekend's incident is early similar to one in 2015 when a woman broke into Chris Brown's home and vandalized his place with what Chris called quote voodoo things. Chris himself found her lying naked in his bed. Well they say naked but I say naked. But this, this, this is crazy man. Listen Chris Light Brown can't catch a break. The Red Bone Renegade. It, 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 people are always testing him. Now they're trying to say that this dude is out here doing voodoo on people. See, it's some Illuminati stuff. Listen, Chris is be being set up. I think somebody put a curse on Chris because it's really funny how so much bad stuff happens to such a good person. Listen, man, y'all better leave my fair skinned friend alone. I I'm so tired of y'all messing with Chris Light Brown. That's, listen, Chris Light Brown dances too good and sings too good for y'all to be coming after him like this man you know well listen y'all Here, here's the thing right do y'all think that this is a setup do y'all think that that woman was sent to his house with that bible with that ridiculous story because this is part of a bigger agenda do you think this is connected to something else do you think that the so-called illuminati are after chris light brown what do you guys think is going on up in here because it does, just doesn't sound right. Some woman in her preteen comes to Chris Light Brown's lawn and throw a Bible over the wall. Talking about, so you did some voodoo on us or him or whatever, allegedly. Crazy, right? And we all know that that was a quote-unquote sister who did that. Let's just be real with ourselves here, my Jesus. We all know it had to be. Because nobody's that fake religious <laughs> other than a sister, so-called. Anyways, let me know what y'all think about this Illuminati voodoo curse below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine. Meat Magazine 7 on Google+. Meat Magazine blog on Instagram. Was this some, some sort of a setup or what? I feel like this man I feel like she exposed herself the second she threw that Bible over the wall this this is nothing but some of that Illuminati so-called Illuminati stuff in my personal opinion y'all may disagree thumbs up comment subscribe click the notification bell he needs better security around this house I mean she could have thrown anything over that wall think about it